Hello everybody, my name is Shay Too Sweet. You can call me Shay for short. And today we're gonna be reacting to the most disrespectful moments in anime. I believe the links for this um for this video down below. And again, I will be a resident black friend talking through the whole entire thing. So let's hey, look, look, I have got a black friend. Ass face. Patted him on the cheek. Then slapped a skull out of his ass. God. Hell no. Till the no, no, no. Hell till the no. Like a pimp slapping an ungrateful hoe. Let's go. Let's go. Alright, y'all. So as we know, in anime, she could get very disrespectful. Like there are some characters out there that will do the most absolute outlandish disrespectful shit. <laughs> That you will ever see in your life. And then you're just sitting there watching, <laughs> looking at the screen like, damn, did they really have to do that nigga like that? Like, there are so many disrespectful yes. moments in anime. I was just sitting down and thinking, shit, why not make a new series? The most disrespectful moments in anime history. Hey, I ain't even gonna lie, bro. There's so many moments out there. This series might be going for a long ass time. So Let's here's go. how we're gonna do it. Each part is gonna have four moments. Cause like I said earlier, there's so many disrespectful ass moments out there. I'm gonna have to put multiple in different videos. Cause I know some of y'all gonna be in the comments. Y'all gonna be like, hey, yo, CJ. Where the f is that moment when that nigga beat the brakes off of that nigga, bruh? Like, I am on a personal mission myself to see every single ass whooping in anime history. Because, like, bruh, I got to add more niggas to the Black Air Force activity table, so why not? So everybody sit what? back, relax, grab some popcorn, get... The Black Air Force table? I, I, I never heard of that. I know what Black Air Forces mean. That means, like, the, if somebody has a pair of Black Air Forces... They don't care about their lives, you know. So it's like you can't trust a guy with black air forces and white tube socks on, you know, they don't really care anymore, type thing. But I, I really hate JoJo, JoJo sucks. <clears throat> sorry, Jada, I'm sorry, I just can't get into it. I can't get into a thing that has better arched eyebrows than me. I love you, baby sister. Get your toes sucked if you want to, god damn it. And shit, let's get it cracked. <laughs> All right, first up, a okay. future member of the Round Table of Black Air Force activity, Aizen. This <gasps> man did some of the most disrespectful shit. My baby's shit in the I've Black Air Forces. An Vegeta. This nigga stopped Ichigo's bankai with a finger. Nigga. A fucking finger, nigga. He didn't even take the time out of his day to block it with his sword. Man said, "Fuck it, I only need a finger for your sorry ass." Hey, look at him, bro. The nigga says, "Oh my." <laughs> really, nigga. <laughs> Yo, this man really just said, I tried to cut him in half at the waist. I guess my finger was too shallow. <laughs> Bro. But nah, nah, nah. You know what was the most disrespectful part of this entire moment? Just feast your eyes on this real quick. Oh. This man stopped his theme song. He stopped the protagonist theme song. Nigga, oh my god. That's gotta be one of the most disrespectful things you could ever do to a protagonist. Stop their theme song with a fucking finger. Like, because for real, like, they was gassing this man Ichigo up. I mean, he just beat Byakuya, they just rescued Rukia, so everything is going great, right? So you thinking nobody can stop my boy right now. He about to smack the shit out of this, oh, I take AP classes looking ass boy. <laughs> this man Aizen really said, cut the music, little nigga. Hey, yo, then after that, this man probably had the best exit of all time. This man just looks down. Down at they asses like you inferior ass bitch. Y'all <laughs> niggas ain't shit. This man takes off the glasses, slicks back his hair with a no gel, my nigga. <laughs> it turns into a whole ass Chad. And I bet you money he planned that. Damn, he look good. I'm sorry. I'm not cheating on Vegeta, but he look good. He looks nice. That shit too. And look at him just looking down on Ichigo like farewell, little nigga. By the way, <laughs> everything that happens in this show. I planned that shit. <laughs> Absolutely disrespectful, <laughs> bro. Hold on, let me do something real quick. And let me just. Oh, see my baby. Do y'all see him? Oh, if 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 there's a Vegeta episode, oh yeah, we 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 best doing it. Look at look at look at that. Oh my god, he's so cute up there. I mean, they nice, but look at him. He's so cute. I I'm just a small Vegeta fan, just a little bit. 
squeeze them in right here. Act like you might <coughs> notice. And uh, perfect. All right, uh, moving on. Meliodas beating the shit out of this big ass purple glue stick. Like this one right <laughs> here was just. Wow. I can't even describe how much of a disrespectful ass whooping this shit was. This man was beating his ass with the most sadistic smirk on his face. This man activated that Black Air Force energy and it was around. <laughs> Just absolutely tearing through this mutated form of Barney. Oh, bro, and this is what the dis. Oh, man. I really do hate. Oh, my God. Okay. I just finished watching Demon Slayer. Like him, I could have like literally. I was gonna turn off Demon Slayer, but 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 the two main characters were too good. That's the only reason why I kept it on. But him whining and complaining and bitching the whole time. Oh my God! I wanted to slap the dog sh out of him. I was so get. I was so annoyed. So annoyed. I mean, I mean, let him stay knocked out and let him keep that like that that you know that nigga energy. But keep that keep that whiny shit at home, bro. This look like a. He looked like he was bitch made, like that whole whiny thing. I don't like that shit. Respect began. He walked up to him with this straight ass face, patted him on the cheek, then slapped oh. the shit out of his ass. <laughs> God damn! Slapped his ass like a pimp slapping an ungrateful hoe. Like, yo, he did this shit with no effort. The nigga skid across the ground. I mean, this is how this shit basically went down, but roll the clip. Water down face, Barney. You should take pride again, your ass beat by me, little nigga. <laughs> um, hello, Earth to dumbass. You're the one shrinking right now. <laughs> no, no. Ah, you're in denial. Well, let me slap shit out of you real quick. What? <laughs> I told your stupid ass, but you didn't want to listen. Let's go. Now look who's the little nigga. So after Fraudrin has a sympathy segment, this man's like, alright, fine, I quit. Just kill me already. And then this man was like, say less. Fuck your backstory, nigga. The man didn't give a fuck. He just killed him. An uppercut from hell with a smile on his face. This man did not fall for that backstory, no juicer. Man said, fuck your sympathy, boy. Get that shit out of here. What anime is this from? I have not I never seen this one before. Leave it in a comment down below. I don't know what anime this is from. And stuff like that. I don't I don't know this anime. Nigga. Then everybody's like, damn, he didn't fall for that backstory, no bullshit. Absolutely violated <laughs> Barney in his final form. All right, next up, High School of the Dead. Oh. <laughs> I hate Man, if you've seen this anime, you know exactly what's coming. So zombie. High School of the Dead is basically fanfare, fanfare. It's, it's like two steps away from hentai. Like, literally. I couldn't watch it at all, but... It, it's two steps away from him. They start attacking the school and shit, so my guy's like, ah, oh, shit, I gotta get my homies out of here. So this dude busts up in the classroom, grabs Ray, and the boyfriend's like, hey, bro, what the hell are you doing? And he tells him that people just got killed at the gate, but of course she didn't believe him. So how did he make her believe it? Ah, fuck it. So drop the shit out of that bitch. Um. Uh, I'm sorry. Um. What? He did this in front of the class and in front of her boyfriend, bro. Oh, no. This man slapped the Do piss this. out of him. <laughs> man took a whole tactic out of niggulations. Like, this man been listening to way... This nigga said niggulations. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. This guy's editing is impeccable. He is too funny. You know, when I first watched uh, High School of the Dead... I was going to go get a snack and then I was coming back and I just saw him just slap this stuff out of her. I said, oh, I said, oh man, I must have missed the part for the buildup of like this. Cause you know, like some animes, like a girl slaps him and she like just keeps wailing on him. And then he finally hits her. There's nothing else. That, I, that's what I found out. Too much future. Nigga was like, Andrew. <laughs> and the boyfriend looking like, damn. He really just slapped my girl like that. Like, yo, nigga, you just got cucked in front of the whole class. Like, straight up into yard, bro. And then she like, damn, that nigga really just slapped the shit out of me. Like, like let's just roll through what happened again real quick. <sighs> shit. Huh? <sighs> <sighs> Bitch, get the fuck up. Time to go. Damn, nigga. Hey, cool. What the fuck you doing to my girl, bro? The fuck am I doing? Nigga, the ops is outside right now. Wait, what you mean, cook? I just saw two niggas get iced out there, jit. The fuck, no. nigga, I ain't kept. Oh, my gosh. Oh. What the fuck is happening right now? I'm not trying to have some of your bullshit. Shut the fuck up. Damn, you just really smacked the shit out of that bitch. Oh, fuck that. Do that. <laughs> bitch, you 
bitch, I told you to shut the fuck up. <laughs> Damn, that nigga sexy as that. Oh, I just got cooked. Damn, bro, nigga slapped the intent. And finally, for our last one, is one of the most disrespectful moments in anime history. This. I do not condone violence on any party. There you go. Men or women. There you go. Perfect. Nigga Kurapika brought a shovel to a fight. What? A fucking shovel. What the f- No, no. Who the fuck thinks of this shit? He brought a shovel so he could be That's called let's in, in in law enforcement, that is called premeditation. <laughs> That's first degree all the way. You thought that far ahead. Th Carry the nigga. Oh my god, dude, this man was on pure demon time. So he starts fighting this big ass Wolverine Kaioken caveman looking ass nigga and beats the living breaks off him. Like, it got to the point, like, this shit was just pure torture. The motherfucker was determined to avenge his plan. And then Uvo was just at the point where, like, he, he just had to off himself. Any last words before you die? Yeah. You look like a girl. God damn it. Fuck you. Shit, I'm bloody as fuck. Where the fuck I put the damn phone? <laughs> Call my nigga later up real quick. Hello? What up, cuz me? Oh, shit, what up, my nigga? What the fuck you been doing? <laughs> yeah, I just called a body, cuz. You did that, cuz? Damn right, the ops dead right in front of me. You want me to take a picture, nigga? Oh, shit, nigga, we gotta throw a body <laughs> for your ass. Shit, let me call up the club real quick. Let me get some drinks up here. Let me get some bitches on our dicks, my nigga. Ooh, ooh, it's gonna be a good ass night, boy. Bro, hurry your ass up so we can start. All right, bet. Let me just bury the body real quick. Wait, the fuck? Bury? Nigga, how the fuck you gonna bury a body out there? Oh, I brought a shovel with me. Wait, wait, wait. What, nigga? You <laughs> brought a shovel with you, cut? Hell yeah, nigga. I came prepared as fuck. I already knew the nigga was gonna die, so I made preparations. Oh, shit, nigga. You got ice in your pants, nigga. All right, then, nigga. Hurry your ass up, then. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> nigga really didn't think I would come prepared. Now I'm time to bury your big ass. Bro, he better than me, cause put your ass in the dirt. Yeah, now time to go get that bitch. Oh, so yeah, that's basically the end. So okay, so that was the that was the most disrespected moments in anime. All right, my thoughts on this is um. I really want to know what this anime is. I'd, I'd never seen it before and everything else. So I really want to know what that anime is. So if y'all know what it is, put it down below. I've seen so many disrespectful moments in anime. It's not even funny, but I, I, I really like this guy's editing. His editing style is magnificent. And hopefully one day my editing style will be as good as his. He, he is really, he's a, he's a goat when it comes to editing. Uh, shout out to him. But besides that, I thought it was funny. I can't wait to do number two. Two. There you go. So, again, my name is Shay Too Sweet. You can call me Shay for short. And, like, my grandmother always said, why do I have this villain post? Like, my grandmother always says, so long. Nightmare. 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 Nightmare.